pretty much this is what the worn gear looks like this is what the new gear looks like and you see that the teeth are worn there's a groove worn in the belts not gripping the teeth it's basically slipping on the teeth this gear comes from the finished transport module which is the module that is between the decurler and the stacker so if you ever get jams in your finished transport module you can simply open the back up and let it run and look for a belt that's not turning that seems to be the most common cause so come on over here this is actually located there's two of these there's a drive one and there's an exit one this exit one is located right here and it's simply held on by two set screws two small allen head set screws so what you need to do is there's an idler pulley here that's on a spring so basically what you have to do is loosen this spring up so that you can release the belt from this pulley and then once it's released you can take this idler gear off this drive aluminum drive gear off and what you'll want to do we should have done this in advance take your set screws out of the old one and put them in the new one and then just slide the new one on go ahead and pause it for a second I have the set screws in the new gear. I'm going to slide the gear on. You'll, there's a flat spot on your shaft. You just want to make sure that one of those set screws is lined up with the flat part of the shaft. Alright, so... Once you have that on there, you just want to tighten your set screws back down. Okay, once your set screws are tight, then in order to reseat the belt, this belt actually the gear, uh, the teeth on this belt look like they're pretty worn, probably from sliding across that other pulley for the, a long time. But what you would normally need to do if your belt was in good shape is just go ahead and disengage the pressure off of this, off of this idler pulley, reseat your belt, and then let the uh, pressure come back on. And then once once the pressure goes back on, there's a screw underneath this pulley that you just want to tighten back down to hold it in place. And then just close your back up and you're back in business. All right.